Hi everyone, it's Fitz with The Daily Delivery. Hope you're well. I'm good. I'm busy. I'm busy. I feel like I all of a sudden became a storm chaser. I got tornadoes all around me, but I'm still going on. Hey, remember, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. Hit the thumbs up, leave the comments, turn on the notifications. Go find a dog and kiss it on the snout. It'll make your soul feel a whole lot better. And today I bring good news. I, I know there's a lot going on with K-State sports. Colin Klein's gone to A&M. There's a whole controversy about a player's eligibility in basketball. I don't even want to get into that right now. I want to tell you something, and I'm going to look straight into the camera. Avery Johnson's not leaving Kansas State University. I hope that made you feel better. It kind of got creepy. But Avery Johnson, by all indications, and we were talking to the family, and we were talking to sources, He's locked in. He's ready to be the quarterback for the bowl game and ready to lead this program into the 2024 season. No doubt, 100%, it's all good. So I know a lot of you were afraid that once Colin Klein, who recruited Avery, would, is moving on to A&M, he might take the quarterback with him. Well, first of all, there, there are some tampering rules out there. You can't just take a player. Um, but uh, I'll, I'll say this. Avery is loyal to the institution, not a coach who's now a former coach who moved on by choice. Avery is ready to be the boss in the QB room. Well, hell, he already is the boss in the QB room because he's so promising everyone else transferred, including an entrenched starter. So yeah, he's not going to go to a SEC school with some other really talented quarterbacks in the room when he can play at a equally good football program and be the guy. Avery Johnson is very K-State, and, and that's, I think, why fans have so connected to him. Not only is he a Kansas kid, uh, but he gets what K-State's about, and he is ready for the long haul here. Now, we live in the era of player tampering, the NIL and the transfer portal, so I'm not going to sit here and say this will last forever. As we know, Colin Klein said a year ago he's got more work to do in Manhattan. The work isn't done, but a year later, apparently, it was. So things do change. But for now, as we head in to the bowl season and the Pop-Tarts Bowl uh, arrives on December 28th, well, your own little Pop-Tart, Avery Johnson, will be there. Oh, that was horrible. I, I regret that already. Avery Johnson will be playing, and he will be back next year. So if you've got a list of things to worry about, here's the Avery thing. Just move it way down out of your sight and go on. Don't worry. Be happy. Everything's going to be all right. I feel like I should have dreadlocks. Do you think I'd look good with dreadlocks? It's hair. It'd be helpful. <laughs>